Alright boys and girls, today we're going to be playing a game called Turn Over and Compare. So in front of you right now you should see um, this paper that we're going to be writing our numbers on. And I have a set of cards over here that we're going to be playing with. I'm going to be player one and you're going to be player two. I'm going to flip up two cards. The first card that I flip up I'm going to write in player one's box and I want you to do the same. And then I'm going to flip up another card and write it in player two's box. And we are going to look at these two numbers and compare. Um, and we will write our comparing symbol inside the circle here. So let's get started. I'm going to flip up this one. What number is that? Good, 827. So let's write that in player one's box. 827. Now I'm going to flip up your card. Which one would you like? This one, this one, over here. Oh, this one? Good choice. What's that number? 697. You are correct. So write that in player two's box. 697. So let's compare these numbers. And when we're comparing numbers, it's important to look at the biggest place value. So over here, I have an 8 in the hundreds place. And in your box, I have six in the hundreds place. Is eight greater than, less than, or equal to six? You're right, it's greater than. So we want that alligator mouth to open up to our bigger number over here. And that means that Miss Baker won this one. All right, I'm going to flip those back over. All right, now back to me. I'm going to choose one in the middle. I'll go for this one. Ooh, 702. Let's write 702 in player one's box. 702. And now I'm going to come over here. How about we choose this one? 564. Let's write 564 over in player two's box. And now let's compare. Where do I need to look first to compare these numbers? Right, in the hundreds place. So let's go over here to the hundreds place. I have a 7 in the hundreds place for player 1 and a 5 in the hundreds place for player 2. Is 5 greater than, less than, or equal to 5? You're right. 7 wins again. Open that alligator mouth to 702. All right, we did a couple in the hundreds places. Now we're going to bump it up a uh, place value when we're going to be working in the thousands place. So I'm still player one, you're still player two, and it looks like right now Miss Baker's in the lead. <laughs> All right, let's get going. I'm going to choose this one right down here in the middle. Ooh, what is this number? Read it with me. 4,882. Let's write 4,882 over here in player one's box. 4,000, don't forget your comma, 882. Where do you want to go? Did you say up here? Up here at the top? Sure. Let's go for, hmm, we haven't picked one over here. Ooh, what's this number? Read it with me. 6,380. Let's write this number in your box. 6,000, don't forget your comma, 380. Now, just like in our three-digit numbers, we are going to be looking in the, th um, the highest place value for these numbers. And we're up in the thousands now, so we're going to be looking in our thousands place. On mine, I have a four in the thousands place. And in your number, you have a six in the thousands place. Is four greater than, less than, or equal to six? Yeah, mine is less than yours because four is smaller than six. So that means our alligator mouth is going to be opening up to your number. Let's do it again. Flip those back over. All right, my turn. I'm going to choose this number. What does this number say? Good, read it with me. 
6,283. Let's write this number in my box. 6,000, 283. Now your turn. I'm going to go right upstairs, right next to mine. Ooh, 5,910. Read it with me. 5,910. Let's write that in player two's box. 5,000, 910. Now let's compare. Remember, we start in our thousands place because it's the greatest value. Is 6 greater than, less than, or equal to 5? Yep, 6 is greater than 5, so that means alligator wants to eat my number. <laughs> Let's do one more in the thousands place. Let me flip these back over. Okay, my number. I'm going to choose this one right down here. What does that number read? Good. Read it with me. 4,291. Let's write this number in my box. 4,000, 291. Your turn. I'm going to choose this one over here. Ready? Ooh. What does that number read? Read it with me. 4,193. Let's write it in the box together. 4,193. Which place value do I need to look in first? You got it. The thousands place. Look at it with me. I have a four in the thousands place here. And in yours, we have a four in the thousands place. That's the same number, so we can't really compare that just yet. So now we move over to the next place value. What is next to the thousands place? Right, the hundreds place. So let's take a look at this number now. I have a two in the hundreds place. You have a one in the hundreds place. Are those the same number? No, so we can compare those. Is two greater than, less than, or equal to one? Yeah, it's greater than barely, but it is. So let's go ahead, and since this number is bigger, the alligator wants to eat my number again. <laughs> All right, and we're going to do one more in the thousands place. Flip those back over. Okay, my number. I'm going to go right here over to this one. Let's read it together. 6,920, and then I'm going to go right here in the middle for you, 5,485. So we forgot to write this in my box, I'm sorry. Let's write 6,920 in the first box. 6,000, don't forget your comma, 920. And this is the number that we flipped over second. 5,485. Let's write this number in your box. 5,000, comma, 485. Now let's compare. When we're comparing, where do we want to look first? You got it, and the greatest value. So that, in this case, is our thousands place. I have a six in my thousands place in my number and a five in yours. Is six greater than, less than, or equal to five? Yep, six is greater than. Alligator wants to eat my number. Miss Baker is good at this game. Let's move up to our next place value. I'm going to get rid of these cards and I'm going to bring out some 10,000 place. Okay, now we're moving up into the 10,000s place. So let me go first. 14,576. Let's write that together. 14,576. Your turn. 15,857. Let's write that in your box. 15,000, comma, 857. So let's take a look in our 10,000s place. I have a 1 in my 10,000s place, and you have a 1. So we got to go next door. Let's check our 1,000s place. I have a 4. You have a 5. 
Well, five is greater than four, so let's eat that number. <laughs> let's go again. My card, ooh, 15,968. Let's write that together. 15,968. Your turn. Let's do this one down here. 14,203. Let's write that together. 14,203. All right, let's check our 10,000s place. I have a 1 and you have a 1. Let's go next door. In my 1,000s place, I have a 5. You have a 4. 5 is greater than 4, so we're going to eat this number. <laughs> Two more. Are you ready? Let's see. I'm going to go up here. Ooh, 13,600. Let's write that together. 13,600. Mm, what are you going to get? Let's see. <gasps> Oh, 13,483. Let's write that one together in your box. 13,000 comma 483. Let's go in our 10,000s place. I have a 1 and you have a 1. Let's go next door to our 1,000s place. You have a 3. I have a 3 and you have a 3. Oh my goodness. Let's go down to our 100s place now. I have a 6 and you have a 4. Which one's greater? That's right, six is greater than four, so I'm gonna eat my number this time. All right, now let's check the score one more time before we finish up this game. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six, and you have one, two, one, two, three. All right, three to six, last one, are you ready? 15,348 from me. 15,348. Now let's see what you get. Hmm, I'm going to go over to this one. 13,678. 13,678. Let's start in our 10,000s place. I have a 1, you have a 1. Let's go next door and check our 1,000s place. I have a 5 and you have a 3. Well, 5 is greater than 3, so alligator is going to want to eat my number this time. All right. Well, boys and girls, thank you for playing Turnover and Compare with me. Uh, maybe you'll get a chance to play this during your game time.